Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you advanced villager trading. So, this is pretty cool and very simple. So, as you can see, I am uh, coming into this guy's shop. And I've been trading with him a while. And I'm going to just trade this paper for an emerald. And you can say... He says, thank you for buying my goods, come back soon. So, I'm going to come back and trade with him again. And I want this enchanted book, so I get it. And he says, hey Microspace, you have been a really good customer for the past year and I'm going to give you access to the back. Grab whatever you need, partner. So, go back. And you can see, well, this is just um, using commands to get it in. But I've used my trading ability to actually um, do things with commands and stuff. So I'm just going to show you how this works. Okay, so this is based on one scoreboard objective command. And it's called stat.tradewithvillager. So um, if I just go show you, so scoreboard, objectives, add, then the name that you want to call it. So I called it trade. And it's a stat dot trade with and oh sorry tr sorry trade traded with villager and then you just go trade um like that. So once you've made that, then we can get into this tutorial. So there's a full clock here, and for each command is something that you want to do with um, other commands. So. This is going to execute all players who's got a score trade, mineral of one, and a score trade equaling one. So if they have a score of trade at their location, and it's going to set block um, at these coordinates with the resident block. So when you've traded with the villager once, it's going to set block a block right here. It's just going to do the tell raw command. Um, thank you for buying my goods, stuff like that. So when you trade with them again, so if your trade score equals two, so min two and just equals two, then it's going to set block a redstone block right here. So what this will do is first of all set your trade to three, so you can't get those again. It will fill the redstone block that's here with air, and also fill the redstone block that's here with air. And it's also going to activate this repeater. And then it's going to say, um, you've been good customer for the past year and stuff. And it's going to give access to the back. And then what these do is just destroy one block. And then um, four ticks later, it's just going to destroy another block. <laughs> 